Hi everybody! Today I'm going to show you how to make my little fish. I used a couple of colors, some gray, white, one band red, one band black for the eye, and uh, one white there. Um, let's get started. I'm using one loom and your loom is going to be like this with your arrows facing down. Right now I'm going to start using with the bone area. So you're going to need six of these and you're going to have to place them to the side. I'm going to show you how to do one using double bands. I'm going to go down twice and using one cap band wrapped around three times. So it's one, two, and three. And now you're going to reach in and loop up. So that's one, and two, and then remove off your loom. And then when you're done place, doing these six, just place them to the side, either like on a toothpick or a skewer or an extra hook if you have. Okay? Now I'm going to show you how to do the tail. I'm going to start just with uh, three bands, gray, at the top of my loom. Just like that. Now using double bands, I'm going to go oops, to my right and now to my left. We are going to go down three times on either side using double bands. So that's one, two, and three. Push it down on my left. One, two, and three. Now I'm just going to go in the middle twice, going down one with double bands, two, and now I'm going to use double bands again and I'm going to stretch from here to here. So just like that. On the other side, same thing, from my bottom right to the middle. Now I'm going to take, just push these down, take two bands and go down. And on the left side. Taking a single band, we're gonna cap here and one there. I'm going to wrap it around three times. One, two, and three. On the other side, one, two, and three. Now I'm going to take a single band and place it in a triangle form for a holding band, just like that. And now on this side, now take your hook and just go like that. So it should look like this. This is the tail. So now we're ready to loop up. So reach in, holding those cap bands down on my left, and now go on the right. Just like that. Now we're gonna loop these bands right here. So reach in, grabbing the two bands. I only got one. And on the right side, to the middle. And now we're going to loop up. Reach in, move that holding band out of the way. Reach in. And to the middle peg. On the right side, move that holding band out of the way. To the middle. Now reach in and loop up the middle. And now to the top. Now this has three bands, so be very gentle and loop up. And pull off. And there's your tail. So you can just place that to the side. If you don't have a side, you can kind of just leave it here if you'd like. An extra hook or whatever. You can just leave it right there. So now I'm going to show you how to do the face. 
using gray bands, I'm going to use double, and we're going to start at the top of the loom. So from your left second peg, we're going to stretch to your middle top. On the right side, stretch to your second peg on the right. So now we need to go down the peg. I'm going to go on my right, and I'm going to go down four times using double bands. One, two, three, and four. On my left, one, two, three, and four. And now we're going to go down the middle. One time. And again. And I have to say I really apologize. I'm just going to lift up this peg on my left and just place it right here because I forgot to put the mouse. So we're going to use one single band. I'm really sorry and just place it from there to there. So third peg down from the middle to your second peg on your left. Now just take these bands and just put them back. Okay, so now I'm going to go down the middle one more time and one more time. Now I'm gonna take two bands going from my left to this middle peg right here, which is your fourth peg down from the middle, and just give it a stretch. Push the, pe uh, the bands down and on the middle to your right. Now I'm gonna go down the middle section with white bands using three at a time. So from here to here, using three bands, from here to here, push down, three, four, five, six, and last time, seven. So you can take your tail and place it on this last peg right here. Just give it a stretch and put it down. Okay, so now I'm going to add the bones. So I have, I'm going to need two. And we're going to place them from the third one down. So from the white, one, two, and three. Placing two. One needs to face the right. Push it down and the other facing there. Taking two more, skip one, go to the next one, place them on, one facing the right, push down, one facing the left. Your next two are gonna go right here the last one before the tail. So right there, place them on. Push it down, face the right, and one's facing the left. Now I'm going to use two cap bands, one band at a time to cap here, 
and here wrapped around three times. So it's one, two, and three. Now on the other side, one, two, and three. Okay? Now I'm going to place some holding bands, one single band in a triangle form from here to here. One from here to here and one from here to here. Now we need to do the eyes. So taking one black, wrap it around your hook three times, one, two, and three. Taking one white band, wrapping it around your hook twice on one side and twice on the other side. Place them, you're gonna slide them on one of your fish color, gray I'm using, and just slide them on. Placing your eye from the second peg down in the middle to the second peg down on the right. Push down. And now we're ready to loop up. So reaching down at your bottom, pull your tail out of the way, reach in, and go forward. Here, you're going to have to slide down, get those three bands. Careful you don't grab any of the bone pieces. There's a lot of bands here, so be careful. Don't pull your hook. Don't stretch your hook. Bend it. And loop up. Loop up. And now I'm just going to stop right here, and I'm going to go on my left side, and we're going to loop these two bands going to the middle. So reach in, watching those cat bands. Don't let them slide off. And go to the middle. On your right side, reach in, grabbing those two bands that are going to the middle. Oh, too many bands. And go for. Okay. So now I'm going to go to my left and loop up to the red one. So reach in. Reach in. And stop there. Going to my middle, reach in, grabbing those two gray bands, and go forward. I have some tension here, so let's just loosen it up. To the red, red band. Now taking your red band, that single band, we're going to go to the left. Okay? So now I'm going to go to my left and just loop that last two bands right to the top. On my right side, reach in. Grabbing those two bands and on my left, right, I'm going up, up, up. Now don't grab this eye, the band that the eye is on and go up. Now reach in and complete the middle. Right to the top. Take one band. And we're going to do a slip knot. So reach in. Grab it. Pull. And do a little slip knot. Okay. Your fish is done. Now it's just a matter of taking it off. Be very gentle. So you don't break any bands. And your fish is done. Now just give it a little stretch, put the eye through, and then you can just fix the eye around. If you want to hide this holding band, just slip through anywhere.
Okay, and uh, he's done. I hope you enjoyed Looming with Cheryl. And I'll see you next time. Don't forget to subscribe below. Bye for now.